Well, I was told during the break we have uh, found some children wandering around backstage. I want to figure out what's going on. Jeannie, bring out the children. Uh, my name's Mallory. Hi, Mallory. And I'm Mackenzie. Hi, Mallory and Mackenzie. And uh, you're just wandering around backstage. Where are your parents? Uh, they're, they're in the, the audience, audience somewhere. Oh. oh. Oh, yeah, they're up there. Oh, come on down then, parents. All right, pass those mics down. Let the adults talk. Uh, OK. Oh, God. Hi. Surprise. Uh, uh, yes. You yes. didn't know this. Uh, no. You uh, didn't know none of this sister. was going to happen. Uh, oh, my God. Hi. Yeah. What? You're Natalie. <laughs> I'm Natalie. You're Nathaniel. Yes. yes. Well, I do know a little bit. That's why you're here. I know a little bit about your sto story. Uh, you want to share with everyone you were diagnosed with cancer. I was. And... Um, right before Christmas, um, December 23rd, I'm out doing Christmas shopping, and I get the call. Um, it's been a whirlwind since um, in March. I had a double mastectomy and was out of work until the end of August and had reconstruction about a week ago. And a I week have... ago? Yes. Man. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. And I have radiation. My first appointment for radiation is Wednesday. All right. Yeah. So you came here to, to get some feel-good energy. Yes, uh, yeah. definitely. Good. Definitely. Oh, yeah, and you're, you're feeling good, though, right? I do. Good. I, I feel good. great. All right. Yeah. 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 So it's never a good time to find out that you have breast cancer ever, but especially on Christmas Eve. Oh. Did you go ahead and celebrate Christmas? We did. Um, we decided we wouldn't really tell the girls what was going on. We just said mommy had a lump. She was going to go get it taken out and everything was going to be okay. Right. Um, but then this one, she comes home from school and unfortunately, a uh, classmate of hers, her mother, his mother died. Mm -hmm. And so her question to me was, mommy, is that what you have? And so we, we had to tell the truth. And then her next question was, are you going to die? Yeah. And so I just told her, you know, I told them, Everyone's story is different. Um, we're just going to be very prayerful. Um, what did you tell us we, we got to do? Um, just said, you know, we're going to um, okay. have one day and cry this thing out, have a super pity party, yeah. mm -hmm. and then we're going to get over both fists fighting this thing and just... Yeah. And just... That's what you got to do. Yeah. Well, I just love this family. That's all. I just love this family. Thank you. We so, love okay. you. So, well, <laughs> yeah. thank you. And Natalie, you wrote in, right? I did. Now, I why did. did you write in? Because of who you are. Um, I was sitting in bed every day, going to chemo every week, and this was the hour that got me through every day. Um, watching you, the way you encourage others. I mean, my story is no greater than anyone else's, and there are people battling cancer every day yes. and not not succeeding. So to be able to sit and watch and laugh and dance, um, and I love the monologues and the Ish. cats and just all of that. <laughs> <laughs> all of that. It was the best hour of every day watching you. Well, thank you so much. That, yeah. you know, that is when people say what I like the best about the show, it really is not the celebrities that I get to sit down and talk to. It's people like you and, and hearing that I make people feel better, hearing that I make people happy, because there's nothing better in the world than hearing that you're making somebody feel better. Yes. So mm -hmm. I know that you want, uh, th th that Christmas must have not been your favorite Christmas. And I know you want to, when you, when you feel better and you're getting through the radiation, go on a little family trip. I got you an early Christmas gift so that you can go on your trip. It is okay. <laughs> Careful. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> so all of the kittens are in there? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you said you I like, like cats. Oh, <laughs> like, nice. All right, let me see. Oh no, it's not that. I forgot. It's twenty five thousand dollars from Charlotte. Oh, oh, no.